Alright guys, quick tutorial on how to get your standard NTEC USB to DMX devices working on the latest version of uh, Resolume 6. Um, so first off, you're going to go to this uh, website, NTEC um, Pro Manager Download. It is a great shell application that um, once installed uh, looks like this little um, NTEC Pro Manager, almost looks like a camcorder, and uh, when you run it, it opens up either Google Chrome or your default browser. Um, you don't have to be on the internet, it's just it's a local host. Uh, upon opening um, the NTEC Pro Manager software, it will take you to this landing splash page um, after finding the device, and it'll, uh, you can select through here, DMX USB Pro Mark II is the one that I have here. There's this little guy with the breakout, little five pin converter, and then we've got this running over to my Noop node, heading out to a music festival this weekend with um, just three LED PARs in it. Uh, this software is great. Once it has your device, you can go to um, DMX Send, which is where we just were before it crashed. And we can go to test patterns, live art net from faders. From faders is a great little demo. Um, so had a little flash. Right now I have one ecstatic fusion in there. It's a seven channel par uh, RGB AW, and then two American DJ pars on the sides, which are just three channel RGB pars. Um, left one starts at channel 10. Right one starts at channel 13, just for shits and giggles, this one starts at channel 1. Um, so turn the master on the ecstatic fusion all the way up. And then we'll have our red here. And so this is just coming from the NTEC software itself. But what we can do is we can do a live artnet from the NTEC device. Um, and it starts listening in on uh, the default local port of um, 127.001 broadcast or 10.0006. Um, you can send out over any of the available ports on your NTEC DMX device. Um, assign your starting universes, etc. And um, then inside of Resolume, we can go into our advanced output here. And you no longer have to go into your preferences uh, to start enabling DMX output. It just is is on and created when you make a LumaVerse. Um, you can change it from a broadcast target IP to a specific IP address and have it send out over uh, your local zero. I, I don't know, fucking, I'm not a big network engineer. Broadcast works great. And um, yeah, so I've got these three little pixels. I've got my um, master on for my Ecstatic Fusion just so it's always up on channel one. Uh, two through six is an RGBAW pixel. Uh, and then 10 through 12 over there is uh, RGB, and then RGB over there, just to spread it out. There's my little DMX output map. Um, you could clean it up, I guess, move one of the pixels over there. Um, but yeah, so now my connect feed, chilling right up there, is uh, controlling, dropping the phone, is controlling the uh, lights through Resolume 6. It's uh, pretty dank.